finally on line 6, I'm executing my pytest file using the python-m command. Consider this. You have an AWS code build project in your code pipeline and now you want to add automated tests to it. Can you do this in a few steps using the AWS console? Let's find out. Let's start by navigating to the code commit service, then click on create repository and give it a name. Hit create, then confirm that you see git clone instructions under step 3. Next, let's head to the cloud9 service, click on create environment and give it a name. I'm going to leave all the other settings to their default values. Hit create then click on open cloud9 ide let's navigate to the bash terminal then copy paste the git clone command use the cd or the change directory command to go inside your repo then let's bring in our lambda_function.py file the code starts by importing the requests and the json module then inside my lambda handler i'm calling this api to grab the current nyc temperature on line 15 i'm returning the current nyc temperature in fahrenheit next let's bring in our requirements.txt file which contains two external dependencies requests and pytest i'm going to save this file in my current directory as well then bring in my test lambda handler.py file In my test file, I'm starting by importing the pytest module and my lambda underscore function. Inside my test method, I'm calling the lambda underscore handler function to grab the current NYC temperature. Then on line six, I'm printing it out on the console. Finally, on line seven, I'm asserting whether the current NYC temperature is greater than 45 degrees or not. Let's save this test file under the test directory then bring in our buildspec.yaml file. Here under the build phase I'm first running the pip install command to install all my external dependencies defined in the requirements.txt file. Finally on line 6 I'm executing my pytest file using the python-m command. Let's save this file under the my test repo folder then run the git add command to add all of our files to the commit index. Next, let's commit all of our files using the git commit command with the hyphen m option so you can specify your commit message. Finally, let's run the git push command to push all of our changes to the master branch. Head back to the code commit tab and go inside your test repo to confirm that you see all your files checked in. Next, let's head to the code build service, click on create build project and give it a name. For source, select the AWS code commit repository that we just created with the master branch. Under environment, I'm going to choose Amazon Linux. for operating system and standard for runtime and image let's leave all the other settings to their default values then hit create build project looks like this service role already exists so i'm going to add dash o1 at the end of it then hit the create button again next click on start build then scroll down to the build log section Looks like both of our build commands under the build phase were successfully executed and our pytest called test_lambda_handler also passed. Now watch what happens if I go back to my test file and change the assertion to current NYC temperature less than 45 degrees. Then commit and push my changes. Head back to the code build window. and click on retry build this time as expected our build status says failed if you scroll down to the build logs you'll note that our test failed because the current nyc temperature is 
which is not less than 45. There you have it. But before you go, here's a question for you. Why did the AWS code build job apply for work at the bakery?